Alright guys, so I just recorded this entire video and then accidentally deleted it, so sorry if I blazed through this one. I'm um, just going to do a SGC return video and then a small mail day combined here. So, um, SGC return here, we got a Kale Makar Young Guns and a 10. Super excited to see what this guy's going to do in his career. Um, it's looking good in the playoffs, just scored a goal yesterday. And uh, this is definitely my favorite card of the order here. Got a clear cut Young Guns. 9.5 uh, Nicholas Hogg Haig I don't know how to say it got a Kirby Doc Young Guns and a 10 Young Blackhawks Center people are really high on this guy so glad I was able to pick up a 10 of him got the Jack Hughes Young Guns and a 10 Sorry about my dogs. The Capo Caco and a 9.5. The reason it's got a 9.5 is because of this factory cut up on the top edge here, I'm pretty sure. The rest of the card looked really clean, so. But 9.5, can't really complain. Got uh, two Braden Point Young Guns and a 10. So, perfect timing for that. They're in the playoffs, doing well right now. Got a Nylander Young Guns and a 9.5. Got two Kyle Connor Young Guns, 9.5 and a 10. I think a 9.5 on this because of the centering, maybe. But then when I look closer, his name is further left over here looks even more off-centered so not sure about that one I don't know once again sorry about my dogs all right and then we've got this Pedersen young guns in a 10 really happy this got a 10 as well we've got the Jack Eichel in a 9.5. reason this got a 9.5 was because of that bottom left corner there. It's got that white showing. Slightly pushed in, so I agree with this grade. Have no problem with the 9.5, happy with it. Alright, and then we've got a Bo Bichette. Player's Weekend uniform. This is the short print in a 10. Very happy about that. Can't seem to get the uh, base series one to grade very well for me, but um, the short prints, I'm doing great. Got a Yordan and a 10 here. Got a Lux and a 10. And then we've got an Aquino and a 9.5. And the reason this got a 9.5 was this corner here on the back. I do not remember sending it like that, but um, otherwise this card is super clean. So, okay with a 9.5, I guess. So, yeah. That's the SGC order. Really happy with my grades overall. Uh, and then I got two separate mail days here, or separate mails here. Um, picked up a lot of five of the update Young Guns, Johnson, Kamano, Blickfeld, Stevens, and Brooks towards completing my set. And then I got a David Ayers Young Guns. So I only need five or six more of these um, to fully complete the set. The most expensive thing I need is Chesterkin, so it um, shouldn't be too long until I've got that done. And then I've got a Miko Rantan in here. I have another one of these coming in. I think he's pretty undervalued right now. 
And then a Sebastian Ajo. I sold my True Gem 9.5. Um, decided to pick up a raw copy, see if I could grade it. I think this one's a little rough. Don't know that it will grade very well. Got some issues on the edge up there. Corner's a little white, so probably just leave this alone, leave it raw. Um, but I wanted to make sure I had at least one copy of him, graded or not. And then I uh, picked up this Hollow Luca from Facebook. This guy had this priced really well. Had it pictured in a one touch. He sent it in the one touch, so appreciate that. Um, the front looks centered, I believe. And then on the back, it's um, kind of off-centered left to right. So I don't know how well it would grade. I think it would do a 9.5 at SGC just because of the centering on the back. And that's assuming the rest of it's flawless. So um, might send this to PSA. I'm not sure yet. But um, yeah. So that's my mail day. Um, super happy with the SGC return overall. Happy with the way the cards look. I have more cards uh, that are heading to them soon. So probably should get those back in a couple months, hopefully. Uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Let me know what your favorite card from the order is, and I'll catch you next time.